Hello, friends. Very, very good evening. It has been such a wonderful, uh, you know, comeback, and I feel so good to be here back talking to all of you in this new ELM life. You might be wondering why I am talking in English today, because today we'll try and keep our entire session in English because we have a wonderful personality down from South, um, you know, Chennai. I just introduce him. But before that, I wanted to share something very, very important with you. You know, I realized one thing that the world is changing very, very fast. And these days, uh, if you tell me what is the one quality which sets people apart from others, I think that's focus, you know, and that focus is the new IQ. Earlier, IQ used to be the, uh, the go to thing for, you know, talented people that he his IQ is 200 plus and that's used to amaze people. Now we can say he can focus, he can keep focused for one hour and then, you know, he's an amazing individual. That's the world. We are in such a distracted world that there is no focus. So today's guest is very special because he has been focused in the area of financial advisory, investment advisory, auditing, accounting from last 20 years. And apart from that, he's been extremely passionate about training people in the area of investments, international forex markets, wealth management, right? He's a chartered accountant from last two decades and has been practicing. So let me invite uh, on the screen the very smiling face, CA Prakashan. So welcome, sir. How are you doing today? Wonderful, Vineet. It's my pleasure to meet you all. Really wonderful Thank evening. And wonderful Thank evening so to all of you. Good evening. Very, very good evening. There are some uh, guests, you know, there are some viewers who are requesting us to do it in Hindi and I apologize to all of them. Today we'll do it in English because <coughs> we want to keep it, uh, you know, he, Mr. Prakashan has a lot of fans down there in South and Hindi might not be understood by everyone. So let's try and understand. We'll keep it very simple. Let's try and do it in English, right? So, uh, you know, I, I briefly mentioned about you. I would like to hear from you, uh, Prakashan, how did you go about your journey? And if you can, you know, share with all of us what has been your journey, especially with respect to markets, right? So what did you do? How did you come into this? If you can share with all our viewers today. Yeah, perfect. As you know that it's all a, a beginning. In beginning, you will make a lot of mistakes because in that time, we don't have such like an e-learn market like platform yeah. to learn and understand the market. We need to read and understand and we need to meet a lot of people, not only from India. We need to go abroad, learn that. But that's a challenging journey. With the passion, we are able to overcome that. And today, I feel that it's like uh, we can meet or enter the market like tossing a coin and do the trade. So make it your trade uh, very simple. Okay, I, I'm also going to share you that trading or investing is a game of probability. So you don't need any emotion. You need a system. So we'll be keep focusing on that as we will share that focus is very, very important. So we need to focus and relax and invest. Definitely the return will come to you. Yes, you said it rightly. Focus is extremely important and a system is also very important for trading. And I'm very excited to learn that system from you today because uh, you promised me that you'll talk about it. So don't hold your horses, just let it go and let tell us everything. So we'll slowly come to those questions. But, sure. uh, you know, let me let me start with very basics. I know that you have been a trader for some time, like last two decades. It has been quite some time and you have seen the ups and downs, right? Uh, I want to start with very basic because the audience wants to understand some very basic concepts and that's the entire objective of this ELM life that let's keep it very, very simple. Let's train people. Let's help people who want to come in the market. So sure. my, my session starts with a very simple question that what is the goal of technical analysis? So if you can briefly define technical analysis for the, the people who are just starting and then what is the goal of technical analysis? Perfect. Okay, so very good questions to start with. Okay, as you know that uh, in the market, we have uh, retail investors and professionals, like you have mutual fund. Okay, fund managers will play the same platform. Retail investors will play the same platform. The difference is 
there is a professional approach okay we we broadly called as fundamental and technical analysis but as a common man okay it's very difficult to, to understand the fundamentals valuation all the things but to make an entry in the market you can focus on technical analysis it's nothing but only a price action you understand today what is the price of a stock from that how you actually whether you want to buy sell or stay away okay that decision only you can arrive through technical analysis so technical analysis is nothing but you are actually forecasting the price of a financial asset like here we are talking about a stock's price okay we are forecasting how we forecast we actually go to the historical data okay you take the historical data and analyze that okay what will be the uh, future of this uh, stocks okay price action whether it will go down or up okay that's a magical question we always ask, ask right whether go up or down so that can be analyzed through technical analysis okay so technical analysis is nothing but you are actually studying the past or historical data to take a decision in the future okay whether price goes up or down so that's what actually simply technical analysis yeah let us go and understand the the uh, goal of technical analysis okay if you go and watch lot of expert okay they will make it more complicated but simply to understand technical analysis say it's a plan okay you are actually uh, making or creating a plan to buy or sell a stock so to understand that you need to first understand the prices are actually always in a trending or range bound market so that we actually study about structure of stock market okay so there are three kinds of structure we actually find out through technical analysis one is a bull market or you can call as an uptrend okay this uptrend actually follow a rhythm okay so the rhythm is nothing but whenever a stock price is going in an uptrend it will have a okay higher highs and higher lows okay so that is the basis of the structure so in bull market we look at price making higher highs and higher lows you just look at last two days okay the rhythm of the market is changed now okay previously you can see that nifty nifty was in a rhythm of making higher highs and higher lows but what happened last two days okay yesterday itself okay actually last week onwards it has changed the rhythm it is not making new highs okay it is actually creating a new low okay that itself is you can read by technical analysis that's where you have to focus on the structure of the market only three rhythm you have to learn okay simply you learn three rhythm okay it's nothing but uptrend okay uptrend you have the feature of making price higher highs and higher lows in a downtrend what will happen it just opposite it will make lower highs and lower lows okay then you have a third kind of rhythm which is called range bound market almost equal high and equal low will be made okay so this is what actually the structure of the market okay so that only you can analyze through technical analysis you cannot go and find in fundamental analysis we talk about in fundamentals the value okay value can be arrived in mathematical formula or financial formula okay but this is is this is a price is actually we are putting in a visualization okay visualization can be understood by anyone you don't need to be a genius okay that's the way you have to create passion so that's what we say that it help us to identify the trend then you know, another very very important thing is when we talk about you can see thousands of video in youtube talk about price action price action strategy okay but you have to understand that see very simple price has to be followed with a momentum okay identifying the momentum say for example a stock's price is going up okay uh, you can see that it's jumping 20 rupees okay next day also it's jumping 20 rupees okay next day is uh, 15 rupees so here you can understand it's going with a momentum say some of the cases you can see that it will go one rupee then it will come back to two okay once again it will move one rupee it will come back to one rupee so that is not followed with the uh, the momentum so you have to look at price action with the momentum there are thousands of technical tools available to understand that so is the objective of or goal of technical analysis identify the momentum then we talk about very simple things okay in market we will have turning points okay when market goes up okay it will stop then it will move okay so to identify the turning point you normally use the technical analysis okay where the 
trend can continue or whether the trend can reverse. So the turning point only can analyze through technical analysis. I also give example so you will understand it will work in a practical scenario. Then we're talking about identifying the demand and supply. Demand and supply is an economic theory everyone knows. Okay. Yeah. When the price action with high demand, what will happen? It keep on moving up. The demand reduces, price falls. Same way, supply increases, price falls. Okay. Supply reduces, price will once again stop or it can reverse. So this four important thing I can say that can be analyzed through technical analysis. What we say? We talk about identifying the trend. Then we talk about identifying the momentum. Then we talk about turning points we can identify. Then we talk about analyze the supply and demand. Okay. So that is I call simply to understand technical analysis. Okay. So we right. can I share the my screen? I think that will be very helpful if you can do that. Yeah. To give examples here. Yeah. able to see me yeah i can see that yeah so what we are talking about uh, the goal of technical analysis identifying the trend identifying the momentum and identifying the turning points this example itself you can see that okay this is a visual representation of a chart okay where the price is actually where it is actually reversing so the same way you look at okay identify the force of demand and supply you can see that price goes up the supply increases price falls okay here also the same scenario the price goes up okay then supply increases i mean uh, price falls so that's what actually we are talking about the goal of technical analysis look at here this is our nifty chart yesterday okay you can look at we were talking about trend okay you look at this chart when price were in an uptrend, we talk about bull market. You look at price is creating a pattern. Okay, it's creating higher highs and higher lows. Okay, but from last week, okay, it was not the case. You can see that the, the trend is changing or the okay rhythm is changing. It is not creating higher highs. Okay, so that's why yesterday you see okay a fall in the market. So that's the way we talk about. Technical analysis definitely help us to identify the trend. Okay, look at uh, here the example. Okay, this also Asian paint. Yesterday chart is a daily chart. You look at even though the Nifty is falling. Okay, but Asian paints the rhythm is different. You look at it's creating high and higher high. Okay, and higher lows. So that is where technical analysis very useful to identify the the rhythm of the market so either uh, uptrend downtrend or sideways market uh, see this is very exciting technical analysis is always you know because it predicts the future looking at the historical data but you know fundamental analysts always have this uh, this question in their mind that does it actually works because you're not looking into the company you are not looking into the financial statements or management or anything like that right you are just yeah. looking at the historical price data, volume data, right? And you are trying to identify what the future will be and take trades basis of that. So is it more like, you know, you see something and you, you know, you, you try to build patterns in the cloud or is it actually, does it work? Okay. We'll, uh, before we explain, we'll take one uh, historical chart and check yeah. that whether it will work or not. So then we'll go for the discussion. I'll just show sure. that. Uh, yeah, say technical analysis really work. Okay, this is I brought SBA, State Bank of India, and also I practically trade this chart. Okay, this is actually a, a historical chart. Okay, you can see from 2010 to 2021. Okay, we'll we'll have the first question whether the technical analysis really work. Okay, you look at the forces of demand and supply. Okay, starting from here. Okay, starting from 2010. The forces of supply, okay, people are start selling around 300, 325, that is the range of the price, okay, or we can say broadly 350. When SBI reaches 350, what happens? The forces of supply is more, 
so the price is coming back okay to around 150 level okay how many times 2012 okay 2014 2016 and also we were predicting or we were talking about it historically that is when the covid hit okay the maximum impact is came back to 150 okay our own clients bought and look at today's price okay we are talking about up to 350 after that we'll discuss later so we talk about it will work how many times you will make 100 percent return more than 100 percent return one two three times okay minimum three times in the last 10 years okay that is 300 percentage return just to you understand the support and the system so the answer is technical analysis really work true so uh, one follow-on question on that so uh, technical analysis is also a very deep subject right it starts from somewhere like as you said you can only learn support and resistance and still can do something right and and then you can go deep and you can learn advanced technical analysis and you know various things so what do you think uh, as a starter how much technical analysis should i learn uh, which can help me in my trading to start with okay i'll tell you you need to learn basic uh, technical analysis first to start mm -hmm. your journey you don't need to mm -hmm. go to advanced class and do the trading okay first start learning the three simple things okay one is the uh, the uh, as i shared with you the backbone of technical analysis the structure or the trend okay so you need to able to understand whatever the chart maybe a line chart or maybe a uh, Japanese candle or you go for an advanced uh, chart anything is fine but basically your duty is at least learn about how to identify an uptrend downtrend and sideways market okay so that is actually the backbone so you start with that then you understand the as I shared with you the goal itself is identifying the demand and supply the turning points okay for mm -hmm. that we have the simple technical tools identifying support and resistance but you need to practice okay then only you know that whether the you are actually reaching the correct support and resistance okay the force of demand and supply are you able to do okay then use a minimum um, i mean uh, indicators don't uh, people say that 200 indicators 10 indicators in the trading okay five indicators in the trade i'll say that if you can do the plain chart trading okay you don't need any indicator but initially to get the grip you need one or two indicators which you are comfortable okay even a magd is fine a moving average is a fine so you don't need to complicate but it's very important that you need to take action okay you can do paper trading how many months okay so you need to slowly get into that's what we are going to focus here okay what is really important okay when we talk about stock market two emotions play one is greed and another fear okay so you create right mindset that's what you have to realize okay what must be your mindset then trade with a simple technical analysis definitely you will make money okay so that's what the objective of this interview itself sure yeah sure and so, understand or add, add further i'll bring you uh, my slide here to understand very simple first we need to understand that trading and investing is a game of probability as i already discussed with you Okay, this is what actually uh, you will have an emotionless trading. Okay, that's where we uh, later will understand that a trading system. Okay, very simple. Okay, so let's say I am planning to trade 10 trade. Okay, the 10 trade uh, where I am using a simple system, let's say a moving average. Okay, but I am defining everything. Okay, that's the plan for me. Whenever I want to win, I want to make a thousand rupees. Okay, whenever I lose, maximum loss must be 500. Let's say my system is excellent. Okay, it is working for me. Out of 10 trades, 8 times I am winning, 2 times I am losing. So what will be my net profit? Okay, 8 into 1000, 8000. And 2 trade I will lose. So 1000 rupees I will lose. So I will have a net profit of 7000. So whenever you start trading, treat as your business and focus on the net profit. Okay, so that is very, very important. It's not the question that each trade somebody say that every trade i can win with my system that is actually it will not work in the market because that's what i say that it's a game of probability okay so make the probability in your favor okay let's reduce that your winning chances reducing because of the market condition 
you are only winning six times, losing four times. Still, I have a net profit. Look at four thousand rupees is my net profit. Now look at fifty fifty. Okay, I am winning fifty, losing fifty. Okay, what is my net profit? Still, I have net profit two thousand five hundred. Look at uh, my the I mean I'm just giving the example last four trade only I am winning six I am losing. So normally I call as a loser. But look at my trading system. Still, I have a net profit. So this is what actually I mean all my twenty years taught me. That is, it's a very very simple trading. It's a game of probability. So you need to build a trading system with this concept. Definitely, you'll make profit. Thanks for you know so so simply explaining the money management concept. Yes. Right? So people say that uh, you know without having a strong trading system, right? It's not possible to make money. Now, what is this trading system? You also said. trading system so what is this trading system if you can explain to our users yeah trading system is nothing but you define your rules of entry and exit okay so whenever i am planning to enter okay if i am using technical analysis what are the technical indicators i am going to use okay so let's let's say uh, i'll give you one example so you will understand you don't need so much of a uh, uh, big system complex system like a simple moving average you can also do trading and investing okay very simple you set a goal that whenever let's take an example 50 uh 50 ema exponential moving average you are using as a trading system okay you are simply setting a rule that whenever price above 50 the moment the price above 50 ema you are going to buy but only condition is i want a trend to reverse okay so when trend reversal and price moves above my 50 ema i am going to buy okay this is my trading system so what i am actually putting in my trading system i am putting a entry rule okay what is my entry rule whenever the trend reverses and it moves above price moves above 50 ema i am going to buy okay when i what price i will exit that you need to know that okay yeah. whether you want to make 10% return 30% return or you want to continue the trend so we have tools for that you can have a stop loss Trailing stop loss, all the things can be brought down. So we are defining entry and exit. Exit can be with a target or a trailing stop loss. Okay, so that you define. Okay, and also you follow that one. That's very very important. People have trading system, but only thing is thousand trading system is there. Okay, ten trading is system is there. One day you will use moving average. Second day you will use MACD. Third day you will Bollinger Band. that will not work okay you have to stick on one trading system test for at least 10 or 20 trade okay that's where we talk about back testing okay and stick on that simple trading system definitely the game of probability will work and you will have net profit okay so that's what uh, i am talking about trading system same way okay you can have in the trading system the money management okay we are going to focus on money management coming uh, slides but i'm talking about you must know that what is the maximum risk you are going to take in that particular trade okay so that's very very important for trading system that you define okay then you follow it every day but there will be lot of block okay because we are emotionally involved in the trading so i'll guide you that how you can avoid that so trading system is a simple strategy or a method you follow every day so that's what trading system wonderful wonderful so everyone should have a system which he has to define on his own right yes so as you yes. said it's, it's it will be great if someone wants to do something should learn the basics all right uh, the basics of technical analysis and starts with trend spotting when it, like in this case you said trend reversal so yeah. things as simple as how uh, how to spot a trend reversal right and how right. to look at eta exponential uh, time rich so so these things needs to be these are simple but you need to have a simple trading system which yeah. you yourself have defined for yourself and then you test it over a period of time and keep improvising it correct so you know in our discussions earlier uh, you you very beautifully summarized your trading success uh, with respect to 3m okay. yes sir right can you share that secret so that everyone in our audience can actually make a note and probably Definitely. take it back from this so that's wonderful 
that is actually your foundation or that is what the discipline we are talking about okay three and four successful trading okay three and four successful trading is very simple and most of us know about that but what we will do we'll miss that three ms while trading okay i'll bring my chart here so you will understand better okay the first m is the mind okay we know that normally people will play with the emotions okay as i shared with you the greed and fear okay that will play a lot in our trading decision okay so here when you have the clear mind okay you can avoid impulsivity okay what is impulsivity okay you will not be able to sit idle okay when you are trading whether there is a trend or not normally what we will do whether trend is there or not we want to do the trading okay when there is no trend we'll make 10 mistakes and finally we'll lose okay so that is called impulsivity okay impulsivity is nothing but you either trend is there or not you want to do trade and make mistakes okay but when you are trained properly in your mindset okay mindset is nothing but when you start doing the trading system okay you will actually document your trade okay that's called trading diary okay when you have the trading diary your impulsivity will reduce okay you will have trading plan then you execute the trade you will note down and you will have a review of the trade where we know that where we make the mistakes okay when you have proper documentation okay then your impulsivity will be reduced and also you can also practice some simple meditation to be calm cool in any situation so that will also will improve your trading because the mindset is the key okay when you are greedy and uh, fearful mindset your decision can wrong so that's where the first important factor in trading is the mindset easily we can practice and create okay so that is very very important and this is the highest percentage of success based on your mindset okay second we are talking about we already discussed okay the method okay whether you are going to do the trading with the fundamental or technical or investing with fundamental or technical that system has to be defined so you know that when we have a trading system we have a strategy and that same strategy we are putting in the market for every day so the trading system will support you to achieve your goals okay so that is called method then another very very important thing okay the money management as i shared with you that trading is a game of probability right so your money management is very very important i given in that example you look at the money management which we are talking about here okay we are talking about thousand rupees reward maximum risk we are putting is only 500 okay the same way when you are talking about the risk in any of the trade okay that has to be minimum okay how you will put the risk management principle in your system let's say if you are trading you will have like simple rules like a day maximum you can lose two to three percentage of your capital in a monthly okay you can say that six percentage of your trading capital is the maximum loss all the things you can learn okay there is a lot of method to adopt that but you need to have the uh, the right money management okay why these three uh, three m's are important is you can look at in this diagram okay you look at the percentage of success okay if you have the money management okay it is contributing 30 percentage of your success and if you have the right mindset look at look at here this is very very important 55 percentage of your success is based on your right mindset okay psychology of trading so you need to practice that okay then you look at we are all behind the strategies okay we will learn a perfect system but what is the success which is contributing only 15 percentage so all put together you can be a successful and rational trader so you need to learn about this intricacies and make it very simple you learn simple technical analysis and start practicing okay definitely you will be a winner in investing and trading so that's what i want to tell you so uh, you know the more i talk to successful traders like you the more i learn from them in terms of not only markets but also you know these these method actually mindset is so crucial in our life right uh, yeah. and, and uh, you know generally from outside people have this perception that 
traders are very impulsive people right because they are all the time and and they are um, and and when they make losses right they they got they get furious so these people are very weird you know perception is that the traders but when i see people like you who are so peaceful and who also mention that you should do some yoga some some uh, you know meditation yeah to to you know that to work on that 55% of the mindset exactly, right? exactly. the methods and strategies are just 15 20% of your entire work correct but people that's, are behind the strategy they forget about mindset that's so true you know and that's true on the investment side also people people correct. focus only on return in investment you know if we if we compare mm-hmm. this with the investment there the most important thing is again mindset which can actually make you stay invested for a long time the patience correct. right the patience is so important and that's more of the mindset because right. there the most crucial part is t the time right and everyone is focusing on on r the return r. right so that's that's the problem everywhere we need to focus on r mindset right and there are some questions i'll quickly take them because they are related to sure. what we have been discussing uh, sure. you know how to handle the noise in a trade is stop loss the answer actually you know yes yeah. partly answer that but yes i want the answer from you also yeah see, see you don't need to bother about uh, how many stop loss you hit okay you don't need to bother but every day go and do the trade as per your uh, trading system because we are not focusing taking huge losses okay see that's what i say that in my trading system which i explain i am losing six trade and winning only four okay four so look at still i have a net profit focus on net profit rather than you are focusing on individual trade okay so because trade take as a your own business okay you need to have a net profit so even you lose okay let's say uh, lose seven and winning three you will have very small losses net losses okay so that's what you need to understand trading is a game of or trading i am not talking about only trading investing and trading is a game of probability you need to understand the probability well and master it absolutely yeah. absolutely uh, you know uh, uh, before we leave for the day uh, i want to discuss about the course which you have on elon markets master technical analysis right exactly and there is a question time. from someone that uh, how to create a trading system which suit their temperament right? okay. so if you can answer this yeah yeah it's very simple okay that's what i say that whatever the temperament you have okay the moment you are trading you are actually only following your strategy or trading system your temper will be down you need to wait the system to say that you buy yourself okay but the moment that is give to your mind mind will say buy and sell every moment okay so have a simple trading system like i told that put a moving average what you are comfortable one line when price goes above that with a trend change you buy it okay you will have a probability you will win so make it very simple and uh, learning yeah. about a trading system is not a tough thing okay you learn about the foundation of uh, technical analysis so as we need says that my course mastering technical analysis which involves from basics to advanced level okay where you can learn about the entire structure of the market and technical analysis and you can also see that i am giving one or two trading system very simple system to follow okay that you see the basically you need to understand something right without learning you go and uh, i mean you are going with uh, a professionals okay they are actually the other side okay mutual fund fii's okay they are all professionals okay hni is invest with that do is of a professional but retail investors think that i can watch a youtube video and do the trade okay uh-huh. so that is not the way okay you know that trading strategy only 15 percentage you need to learn about the psychology of investing and trading definitely you can learn okay you don't need uh, i mean you do you don't need to be a genius simply you can learn okay this uh, course master technical analysis actually a uh, very very simple i am explaining like this okay each concept okay you can definitely learn about that and definitely that will uh, give you more edge in the market because you are actually growing towards uh, to become a professional okay that's what the aim of the course good to know that you have uh, shared some trading systems also in the course yes. right so and and uh, you know i really like one thing about your entire work that 
you have been training people across the country uh, over last 20 years yes even before when sebi actually started working on this yeah, aspect i shared with you vinay right we started yeah. the investment education from 2000 okay we got absolutely free we spent our saturday and sunday traveling across not only in chennai i'll go to yeah. hyderabad bangalore and even i set up a company in singapore to train the people absolutely creating an awareness is a great opportunity our market is just is in a growing phase still you True. can see a lot of opportunity youngsters and even people are that passion okay create that passion because you know one thing if you really want to be wealthy you need to invest that's the truth definitely. yeah so you learn and invest definitely you will become wealthy and happy so so nicely summarized actually you cannot grow your wealth until you create a portfolio income until you create an income which is other than your earned income your daily income yeah. which you out, get out of business or salary this money has to go and get channelized in investments right so 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 nicely put and and uh, i'm very thankful that this course of yours is is such a wonderful course with such content and it's available at only at 1770 rupees and yeah. on that for next two three days uh, you have agreed to give a discount of 40 percent yeah exactly because this course the aim is to reach people and they can start learning and create a approach towards professionalism okay so yeah. that's what we are, yeah that's what the objective because my passion is to teach okay and share the knowledge definitely that will be definitely helpful for each one of you we'll try and spread the word as much as possible we have put in the link in the chat box. It's there in the description also. And the coupon code is MTA40, right? So okay. anyone can look at this course and, uh, uh, you know, they can definitely subscribe and they'll get it at less than 1000 rupees and where you have also shared your trading systems. So I think it's a wonderful opportunity for all our users. And I'm very, very thankful to you about that. And Special also, movie. thank you so much for taking out time and sharing your heart with all of us. I think it's great even for experienced folks to come back to basics as basic as stop loss, right? You stop loss actually is the integral part of your trading system, yeah, right. right? And that takes away the emotions from you. If the sure, yeah. trade is going on into loss and your limit is 500 rupees, let's say it, it forces you to get out of the trade. Sure. We are right. right? So simple things like this actually needs to be practiced and needs to be, you know, someone needs to tell us or remind us that you need to do this. And thank you so much for doing that today. And it has been a wonderful conversation. Uh, we'll probably connect once again in the future with more questions, sure. different questions. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, Vinay, uh, for giving this opportunity to meet, meet all of you and to share my knowledge. Thank you so much. Great thank time. You. Take charge. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, so friends, don't forget to subscribe to Elon Markets channel. We have been trying to bring in the best experts in the industry to you. We continuously evaluate new experts so that the spectrum of knowledge enhances. Every expert has his own expertise, his own way of looking into the markets, trading the markets, investing into the markets. And we try and bring it to you so that we learn from all of them. We'll try and keep this series ELM live as lively as possible. And that can only happen if you subscribe to our channel. And if you show us your love in comments in uh, by clicking a like button in this video. And also don't forget to share your feedback with us. Right, That's very important. That helps us in improving the work we are doing. Right, You can directly connect with me. My name is Vineet Patavari. You can search me on Twitter or LinkedIn. And we can be connected over there. You can share your feedback directly with me. I would love to implement that in the organization. Thank you so much, friends. Uh, see you again next Tuesday. Until then, take care. Goodbye. Thank you.